to Live It Up Girls, I'm Daniela, and today we're going to show you the quickest way to take off your nail polish and how to dry them. Hey, so do you remember these? Yep, you're right, they were our glitter hair clips. You can also find these on our website, Live It Up Girls. If you think these are cool and you want to try to make them, then go to our website. So back to the nail polish. Let's get started. So what I'm going to show you today is the quickest way to take off your nail polish. So I know that I don't take off my nail polish as often as I should. When it starts to chip, it doesn't look very good. But it takes so long to take off your nail polish. But with this method, you're only going to need one cotton ball to do all ten of your fingers, a towel, and some nail polish remover. So what I did is I took my nail polish remover and I poured a little bit of it into the top. You only need a little. Then I take my cotton ball and I unravel it. And with the bigger ones you want to try to unravel it just like that. And you want to try to get as much as you can unraveled because you do want 10 pieces. And there might be a little left over but that's okay. And then if you still have this, take go back and unravel it once you need more. Okay, so now you take just a little, only a little to fill off your first finger, and you don't want that much because trust me, it will travel. And you just want enough to fill up your whole entire finger, like that. Then you take some more, and you want a little, and just take that, and if you have a little too much, just pull a little off. There we go. My next one. And if you have too little, you can go to your next finger and fit the size. It looks like a little too much, but it's okay. It doesn't have to be perfect. Take that. Put that on that one. And then take this. And then you can go back and push it down so that it really gets all of that nail polish remover onto your nail so that when you slide it off, just like that. So now I have all of my 10 fingers on with the cotton ball covered and I've waited for one minute and as you can see this is the remainder of the cotton ball and as you can see we've only used half, less than half actually. So now we're going to start pulling it off with the remainder of the cotton ball. Just like that. Then we're going to take it again, we're going to go swoop, just like that, and then we'll do my pinky, just like that. And it's all done. As you can see, that's a way better. Oh yeah, I almost forgot. If you have glitter nail polish on, it's a little harder to take off. But with this method, you might just have to do a little bit more scrubbing. Or, in the next video, I'm going to show you how to take your glitter nail polish off. So now I'm going to show you an easy way on how to dry your nails. So what you do before you start painting your nails is get a bowl fill it with some water, and put some ice cubes in it. So, now I'm going to paint my last nail that I haven't painted yet before I stick them in the ice cold water. And you can talk on the phone, you can maybe just read a book, but right now I'm going to watch a little thing on my iPad. 
see you soon. Alright, so now I've let my nail sit for about a minute, maybe a little longer there, just so it gets mostly dry. And so now, as you can see, when I touch my nails, they're completely dry. That's mostly from when I was painting them, but on this finger, there's nothing there. For more cool, fun activities like this, go to www.liveitupgirls.wordpress.com. See you there. Thanks for watching. Bye. Hi, everyone. Welcome to Live It Up, Girls. I'm Daniela, and today we're going to show you the quickest way to take off your nail polish and how to dry them. So, do you guys remember these? Shazzy! Cheers. Everyone, welcome to Live It Up, girls. I'm Daniela. God. Whenever. Okay, fine. But what do I say? This is my dog Uma. I love him. Okay. So when 